We're going to Rincon. Rincon is this um, small village like by, by the ocean where Ooh, in 2018 ocean. we put in a playground there. Ah. So it's a it's a it's an interesting little town. It, when we first came to the Canada here and we were um, looking to, to put a playground, originally it was supposed to be right in this area here, Santa Catarina. There's a the Bert Tabaris um, school here they have. Mm -hmm. um, and since we were building a playground for Nueva Tavares, it made sense to do it here. But the, um, the, when we met with the president of Canada, he, he said, There's, the kids in this area have a lot. There's a lot of activity and a lot of things going on. There's some like playgrounds, stuff like that. But he thought of an area that was ideal to have a playground um, in Rincon. And he had made a promise to the people of Rincon that he would help develop that area. Is a very impoverished. You'll see when you go there. Really? It is very poor community. A lot of children, and uh, he thought that having a playground there would really help uplift that community there. Um, nice. So we built it in 2018, and uh, I mean it's beautiful. Um, and I'm really looking forward to seeing what it looks like now. You know how how does it look? You know after a few years, and a what a difference that? it yeah. they've made in that community, yeah. kids. So. so we're going to meet those children. Yeah, we're going to go see children. Because we're going to go see the school. I, yeah, um, yeah, there's a school in, in that area there. Mm -hmm. um, so it'll be interesting going back. Uh, and we we've only gone back after we built a playground. Pretty much we build it, we go, and we never come back. Brava is one that we've we've been back to and we visited the one in Brava because we've gone there for other things. But um, this is going to be the first one that we've gone back and, and visit. Fogo is another one because we're passing through Fogo. Yeah. We, we've seen that one. But it's going to be interesting going back and seeing the playground after a few years. I talked a lot more than I remembered from the last time, but uh, it feels like coming back to home. Uh, it was a wonderful trip. Looking forward to the cows <laughs> on the road. But there's so many children. Because I didn't know Maria, Jamoya, Jamoya, Kenobe, Jamoya, the Grace, in the Grace, Maria. She goes, ah, for the ones she saw already.
it's so great to be back here in Ring Kong. We were here in 2018 when we first came in and built uh, the playground here. And it's amazing uh, how this started. And it started because the president of Canada wanted to, to really change the community here and, and have a place where the kids could come and play. Because outside of this playground, when you walk around here, there really isn't much for the kids to do. And there's a lot of kids here. So having this playground here, an opportunity, and it's connected with the school where they could come and really release some of that energy and really have uh, a place to play. And we do believe that a child that, that uses play, using sports, uh, that they're going to be better learners and they're able to get rid of some of that great energy that they have. And this is really building. It's really part of building who they are. And having a playground just makes such a difference, for, especially for a community like Lincoln. Oh!